Hello YouTube. Okay, so after hours and hours of troubleshooting, uh, I've been able to fix my little problem here, which uh, apparently is quite common. Uh, I don't know if any of you have seen this, but when you after you got you know your nice Windows 8 installed and all that, you get this little error right here where it says digital audio uh, HDMI not plugged in. Very frustrating because I'm trying to use an HDMI cable to plug my computer into my TV, which used to work just fine. Okay, so I got a new motherboard. It's a Gigabyte. I don't remember the exact model, but it's a cheapy one. Um, anyway, so it's not playing any sound. It's very, very frustrating. See that? Nothing at all. So I've gone through hours of you know forums online and stuff. They're talking about uninstalling drivers and all that, and I've done everything under the sun like that. And I even went as far as going into my BIOS and disabling the onboard uh, audio, which didn't seem to help at all. Um, so by accident, actually, I was tinkering, tinkering around in my BIOS, just overclocking and stuff. I discovered something. So let me show you what you can do to fix this little error. So you're going to go ahead and restart your computer. Hang on one sec. Sorry, I'm still a little new in Windows 8. I just got it installed today, so bear with me. I'm still learning it. Okay. So I'm restarting it. What you're going to do is you're going to go into your BIOS. Now, if you're not familiar with this, um, it's, you know, I wouldn't mess around with it too much, but it's pretty much fail safe. Uh, just most of the time you're going to hit delete to go into your BIOS, but, mo you know, different motherboards have different ways. Sometimes you'll hit escape or F7, you know, F9, whatever. Uh, anyway, that'll bring you to this nice, lovely blue screen here. Um, now, the one I went under, now, not all motherboards will have this, I don't think, but this one did. It's under MB Intelligent Tweaker, so Motherboard Intelligent Tweaker, MIT. This is a gigabyte board. Um, so I just go into that. This is also where I happen to do all of my overclocking, as you see, um, where you can unlock cores, you know, adjust your RAM settings, all that. I, I stumbled across this right here. It says IGX Configuration. So out of my curiosity, I decided to hit Enter, and I noticed it actually has some HDMI settings in here. Look at this. It says Internal Graphics Mode. VMA and then it says you you know VMA frame buffer size and all that good crap so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go down to onboard VGA output connect where it says D sub DVI is the default settings you're gonna hit that then you're gonna go down and select D sub HDMI that was the problem it wasn't going through the HDMI the whole time it says it was unplugged but it wasn't everyone thought it was drivers and for some reason this hasn't been solved anywhere on Google that I could see so, you're going to change that to D sub HDMI, press the F10 key, that'll save your settings and exit. Now, watch how fast this boots up, actually. This is pretty cool. So far, Windows 8 isn't too bad, actually. Um, I'm having a lot of fun with it. I'm still getting to learn it, though, like I said. Watch this. It's like, I think a total of 20 second boot time altogether, including the boot load screen. Sorry if the camera's too shaky, I'm kind of moving around. Okay, bam, it's loaded. Oh, I forgot my own password, hang on. Okay, now watch the magic. I'm going to go to your desktop, right click the sound icon down here. Go to playback devices, and I'll bring it back here. Now look at that. It says default device. Now here, we're really going to test it out. You're going to right click it, click test. Listen. Bum, 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 bum. And that is how you fix that dreaded unplugged HDMI issue. So if you guys need any more help with this or you know I wasn't quite clear enough, please post comments, message me. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. I just really hope I helped some of you guys out because this was torture for me. Um, once again, this is Xbox 360 Chicken. You guys enjoy.